A year has passed since we began telling our story publicly, and in that time we've talked to hundreds of survivors. We tell them our story, we bear witness to theirs. And while the specifics may differ from person to person, we're different ages, different genders, we live in different parts of the world, we have different religions and ethnicities, there are common threads that run through them all. And of those hundreds and hundreds of survivors with whom we've spoken, something has become abundantly clear. It's not just about the abuse. It goes deeper than that. It goes to the aftermath. And the aftermath can be much more painful. And the aftermath is how others around us react to our abuse. No one can guarantee you that your child will never be sexually abused. But if they are, you can play a huge role in their path to healing. So we've asked our community of survivors to come forward and share with us what they wish had happened after they were abused. I wish my mother had reacted more calmly, so I wouldn't have been too afraid to tell her the whole story. I wish I would have told my grandmother what my stepfather had done to me. I was afraid, but who could blame me since my own mother didn't believe me? I wish someone had told me that when my family fell apart, it wasn't my fault. They spend a lot of time telling you the abuse wasn't your fault, but say nothing about the aftermath. I was very young, so I didn't have the right words to describe my experience, though I tried. I wish someone had taken the time to wonder and investigate and figure out what was going on. I wish my abuse was seen as the problem, not by talking about it. I wish others wouldn't be so shocked or weird at the sound of uttering the words, I was sexually abused and raped. Why should my abuse make me feel defective? Because adults or family members can't cope or handle my abuse. I wish someone would have noticed my pain and the pain I inflicted on myself to try to cope. I wish my parents had worried less about protecting my abuser and more about protecting me. I was the victim. I wish I had felt safe in my own home, my own room, and my own bed. I wish my mother would have noticed how many back rubs my stepfather gave me, and I wish that she would have sensed the feeling that she was interrupting something when she walked in. I desperately, desperately wish that my mother had chosen me and my daughter over her husband. I wish someone listened. I wish someone noticed. I wish someone protected. I wish someone fought for me. Sexual abuse does not have to be a life sentence. Maya Angelou said, when we know better, we do better. Let's do better by our children. Let's listen to the voices of those who survived. <laughs>